Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel Microsoft Office Learning. In this video, I'm going to discuss with you average formula and average A formula. And last, I will discuss the difference between these two formulas. So stay tuned and watch till the end. First of all, average formula. If I want to average the values in these columns, I will use the average formula A, B, E, R. Very first, average, press tab. Now I will select the range. Select this range and then close of bracket, press enter. Now you can see it has calculated the average of all the values within this column. If I want to copy for the next column, I will just simply drag from the bottom. And now I will use the average A formula for the same two columns. We start with equal to A, V, E, R, A. Second number average A, press tab. Now select the range and then close of bracket press enter now if i want to copy this formula for the second column just drag from the bottom and it will give me the average so now what's the difference between these two formula when i apply the average formula for the first column it's giving me 450 and when i apply the average a formula it's giving me the same 450 whereas the second column Average formula is giving me the 360.75, whereas the average A formula is giving me the 288.6. Why average A formula is giving me the less value than the average formula? It's because of this cell. Because every simple average formula does not consider the alphabet, whereas average A formula it considers numerical and the alphabet as well. That's why there is difference in the values of the both formula for the second column. So this is the way these two formula works. Hit the like button if you like this video and make sure to subscribe my channel if you want to watch more tips and tricks. So I'll see you guys in next video.